hello everyone and welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to show you some simple flowers and leaves and vase in it so i'm going to show you a very simple technique to paint a transparent vase and for that you need a few brush so i'm using this size 7 drawn brush and uh, you can use flat brush as well as i'm going to use wet and wet technique so you can use little bigger brush to wet in your sheet i'm using 300 gsm watercolor sheet and simple pencil to draw some basic structure so i need a vase structure but uh, you can you can draw a structure like mine or you can draw whatever structure you like to draw so take your time to draw whatever you want to draw do it nicely so i'm taking my time going back and forth multiple time erasing my stuff until i'm satisfied with with my structure so i'm creating an oval kind of vase here so you can paint or you can draw whatever structure you like to draw so once done you can keep your structure aside and let's start with the uh, flowers and the leaves first so for the flower i'm using red and the pink mix so with the help of red and pink color i'm creating some basic petal structure so with the help of size 7 round brush i'm pushing my brush a little bit to create petal like this i'm keeping a very fine negative space in between these petals as you can see so negative space means a little gap in between your petals and i'm creating a group of petals like this to create a single flower you can create any flower whatever you like i'm creating this flower but you can create whatever flower you like to paint and i'm repeating this process in the round shape my direction of petals are in different different uh, direction towards left towards right and try to achieve a round kind of shape Okay, I think this is enough. Now you can draw one more uh, flower. This one is little smaller but the process is same. Now I am creating a stem for both the flowers with the help of sap green color. So I am creating this stem till my vase, I am not going inside my vest so i'm going to uh, paint my stems uh, inside the vest later and i have to do it because my vest is transparent so i can see my stems inside the vest as well create some basic leaves so i'm creating these two strokes leaves keeping a negative space in between I'm using deep green and sap green mix for the leaves. Create as many as leaves, as many as flower you want. And for now I am keeping my flowers and leaves outside the vest. You can also create some foliages 
before that i am adding few more petals into my flower to make it more bushier or to make it look like this multi layered flower and then add foliages in it with the help of green color itself it's time for vase so i'm um, wetting my vase area with the help of clean water so i'm using flat brush you can use your smaller brush as well but try to fill all the area all the edges of the vase and apply a fine layer of clean water and then with the help of grey color which i have achieved through uh, burnt sienna and uh, blue mix so if you mixed burnt sienna and blue you will get something like this so i have mixed more blue and less burnt sienna in it so i'm getting more uh, blue in this and i'm going through the corner and towards the base and towards the ellipses of my vase first and i'm keeping the center clean for now and with the help of clean water just try to bleed your color in the center space but not in all the area just keep negative space as well so as you can see i'm not filling the color throughout my vase i'm keeping the white area as well so these white area is important now with the help of green color you can extend the stems of your foliages and stems as well but as the area is quite wet the color is bleeding but that is fine we can fix it so apply more water in that particular area so apply water here and then with the help of tissue paper you can just grab some color from those area so this technique is very nice if you want a blurry texture in this particular area plus if you want to dry those particular area with the help of tissue paper now with the help of dark color just go around and highlight some of the area like ellipses of the vase and corner of the vase those kind of area you can cover believe me this is the easiest way to paint a transparent vase without any reference you just have to make sure you need highlighted areas and you need white spaces in your vase whenever you try to blend the color make sure your brush is not too wet and not too dry to blend the color and then you can add more stems inside the vase you can also add few more leaves
these things are optional if you want you can add i'm creating the base of the vase a little bit with the highlighted texture in it highlight the corner with the dark shade you can also add dark shade towards the edges both left and right as the light is coming from the center and just try to blend it and i think we're done with the vase now and a little bit of reflection in it with the same color i'm using same color and we are almost done with the flower leaves and vase i hope you have liked this painting do let me know if you guys have any feedback for me and thank you so much for all your love and support and thank you so much for watching